Welcome back again. Today I wanted to show you another publisher. For first we have taken how to create a publisher or a publication, how to open, how to save it, and how to exit the publisher. So today I wanted to show you another one, how to create a calendar in Amis Publisher or using publisher. So let's open a new one using uh, as a normal go into introduction go into start menu and then go to all apps as the normal and then go to publisher make sure to office publisher yes. from here i wanted to select what i wanted to design calendar this is the calendar click on it you open these are the templates of the calendar before this you select one the design that you want for example i'd like it to take this one the borders one so there's a customization you are doing before you go to down Go to default template. This is a template template. You change it to color scheme. Take this one. It seems like that. This is for form of business form. This is a font scheme. Font scheme for the. This is the text. This how your text will look like Arial rounded like this. And this is a business information. Business information. You can use it. And we will take another lesson for this business information is very important to use in publisher your publication this is the landscape this is the orientation the page orientation you are using whether it's landscape or portrait you select one of these leave it as default the page size so before I create you select time frame what I'm creating is a calendar. So the calendar should have one month based or one year based by page. So one page is for one month. And this is one month one year by page. Mm. So one month by page is this one. And then I wanted to schedule my calendar from start menu, uh, start date and the end date. The start date is the May 2020, which I mean, and the end date is the May. You have to change this one. I want to give this is January from January 2020 or 2021 as you desire. And then this is May. The end date will be December. This is very important before you create your calendar. You have to look at this and then click on OK. It starts from January to end is to December. So if you wanted to include an event, you click on, you tick on here, you check it, and then you write there, you add your event is there, you create it in your business information. It will be like this. You see in the template, these are the informations that you have here, the business information. So now I'm using a default one. So I click on create to see how my publication looks like. It looks like this. I have here in January. This is the January. This is the information. This is the information. <clears throat> I didn't create any business information. This is the business information that you wanted to create it. And this is the logo. I will show you. So this is January. You go to the next on the thumbnails there. This is February and also March up to December. It looks like this. They are all here. You see? They are all here. Up to December. This is the December. So if you wanted to create a one month by page, it's just like this. You can change it even if you want to change the page size or the page template. You can change it so let me save this one 
and then where do I save? I have a publisher here, eh? sorry. Online and in my folder, and then one month, and then save it. And then I go to file instead of uh, starting a new one. I start in, uh, inside the publisher with a new publication, click on new, and then I click on calendar. Go to calendars. This is the calendar. I start it from here. I'm having the choice for this or I will take another one. And then I change the color scheme like this one. And then the font color, the point scheme colors. Consolas. And then this is the landscape or portrait. Leave it as the way it is. And then I wanted to create one year. You see 12 months in a beach so i said the calendar no need for setting it instead of you are changing this year 2020 if you are using 2021 you use like this 2021 it changes into 2021 automatically and then click on ok now what i'm creating is 2021 calendar and then click on create if you want any information you create in here click on here and then click on create new then create this is my calendar it looks like this 12 months in a beach there are no more templates here you see thumbnails only i have one one beach that is 21 2021 Rising my beach like this. Yeah, this is how you create it. So you save, click on save, and then click on publisher, and then name your file. Name the file to all of my. Yes. So that is the lesson for today I wanted to show you for my video. If you are new to us, please subscribe the channel if you watch the video and share with your friends. Please be with us. We are here to cover the needs of our community to build them at the side of technology because the world is growing. The world is growing. All things becoming online. So you have to look this and take your computer and do what I am doing here. Soon you will be a teacher. Just to communicate with us and leave a comment below. Thank you for watching again.